Today's topic is how you can reduce the risk of psoriatic arthritis if you have psoriasis. Psoriasis is an inflammatory condition that comes about due to an overactive immune system. While it may seem simple to deal with, psoriasis can further lead to another inflammatory condition known as psoriatic arthritis, PSA. Psoriasis affects your skin, whereas PSA affects the joints, causing pain and making it difficult for you to grip and hold objects. While there is no known way of preventing PSA, you can reduce the risk of getting it with these eight tips. Number one, add more fruits and vegetables to your diet. Since PSA is an inflammatory condition, reducing inflammation in the body can decrease the risk of getting it. Eating more fruits and vegetables will pump your body with antioxidants, which will help get rid of free radicals. Removing free radicals from the blood helps reduce inflammation. Number two, be active. Stress can cause inflammation to increase, and you need to reduce stress if you want to avoid PSA. One simple way of doing that is staying active. Several studies have pointed out that exercise helps reduce inflammation markers. Exercise helps improve mood and decrease stress, relieving your body of some of the pressure it's feeling. Number three, add more healthy fats to your diet. Omega-3 fatty acids and other healthy fats have been linked with a decrease in inflammation. You can find these fats in salmon and other seafood, with a Mediterranean diet as an efficient way of getting the healthy fats. Number four, avoid physical injury. Psoriasis flare-ups often occur in areas where the skin has been scratched or cut. Scientists believe that these flare-ups due to injuries may lead to PSA as well making it important to avoid physical injury. Number five, manage your stress. As discussed earlier, stress can lead to increased inflammation. Managing your stress while dealing with psoriasis is important, and you need to do whatever helps you accomplish that, whether it's exercise or avoiding your stressor. Number six, monitor nail changes. Nail changes are also linked with psoriasis flare-ups and can increase the risk of PSA. You need to monitor your nail changes and check if you have any reactions after one. Number seven, take medication as prescribed. You need to be consistent with your medication and take it as prescribed to reduce PSA risk. A single setback or inflammation flare-up can increase the risk of PSA and you need to be vigilant to make sure that does not happen. Number eight, Stay in touch with your healthcare team. Make sure you stay in touch with your healthcare team so you can ask for advice whenever you need it. Thank you for watching our video. Please do not forget to like and share the video. Also, please subscribe to the channel to stay updated on our latest videos.